Last Sunday, we told you about a WHO report that listed several chemicals as potentially cancer-causing, including glyphosate, found in the popular weed killer Roundup. Now, in an interview for an upcoming French documentary, a Canadian scientist has been caught in an Aaron Brockovich-like moment when he's asked to defend that chemical against links to cancer rates in Argentina. Take a look. I do not believe that glyphosate in Argentina is causing increases in cancer. You can drink a whole quart of it and it won't hurt you. It's, yeah, uh, it, you want to drink some? We have some here. I'd be happy to, actually. But you, not, not really, but... Not really? I know it wouldn't hurt I mean, me. If, if, if you say so, I have some glyphosate... No, no, I'm not stupid. Ah, okay, so you... you, you no, but I know... So that, it's dangerous, I right? Know, I, no, people try to commit suicide no, with no, it and no, fail no, fairly regularly. Tell the truth. It's, it's not dangerous, dangerous to humans. No, it's no. not. So are you ready to drink one glass of no, glyphosate? No, I'm not an idiot. The clip is being shared widely. But despite headlines like these, the man being interviewed, Patrick Moore, is not a lobbyist for Monsanto, the makers of Roundup. Attention. He is, however, President known Nixon for controversy. Canceled. I have somehow evolved into an environmentalist that supports nuclear energy and is somewhat skeptical of human-caused climate change. Moore spent years early on with Greenpeace Canada, but it no longer recognizes him as a supporter and accuses him of turning into a paid mouthpiece for polluting companies. Meanwhile, glyphosate is still approved for use in this country, though Health Canada says it's looking into the WHO report.